Hey everyone. Hey dear brothers and sisters, welcome back. I want people to see this. I'm so troubled that people don't see this. It's so weird. If you research these things, Freemasonry, the biblical world, biblical cosmology, the truth, the meaning of life, you will find Jesus. And then unfortunately, you will find the fallen biblical world. We're told in the Bible that Satan is the quote-unquote small g God of this current age. And it's true. Many people worship him. Many people have sold their souls for rock and roll. I would hope that anyone's too no I would hope that anyone is not too far gone. And all we can do is pray and keep trying to shine light on the darkness. That's what I'm trying to do on this channel, along with my brothers and sisters in Christ, thousands of them. There's thousands of Christians, maybe more, that do understand these things and do see this. Let's look at music artist Diego Val. He's throwing up the devil horns here. Is it because he's super rock and roll? Is he a big ACDC fan? Again, he's throwing up the devil horns on both hands. Is he just a rock and roller? Is he just a big fan of ACDC? You know ACDC, Highway to Hell, Hell's Bells. They sold their souls for rock and roll. A lot of people have sold out in the same way. He's using a donut to do one eye symbolism, darkening one eye utterly, the eye of Horus. That's what he's doing here. He's doing the vow of silence, keeping the secret of the biblical world about how fame, fortune, and success actually work, and most likely about Freemasonry. I mentioned Freemasonry because that's what these people are. They're Freemasons. The god of which, quote-unquote, small g, is Lucifer the light bearer. It's the false light of Lucifer. They are being deceived the same way that Adam and Eve got deceived in the garden, Right? They're not listening to God. They're listening to Satan. I know that's hard for some people to take, but honestly, the people that don't realize this haven't researched, probably don't read the Bible, haven't like dissected the truth and really like seek the truth of all heart, mind, soul, and strength. In 2015, I wanted to die. I was done with life. Instead of giving up, I decided to seek the truth. I found brothers and sisters online that are passionate like me, we're trying to get the truth out there to wake people up because it is. It's, it's a type of awakening. You go, you went from believing in the secular world when everything's fine and just whatever, and then you realize it's biblical and what you do matters. Everyone's a sinner. These people take pride in it and they get fame, fortune, success. They're involved in Freemasonry and they get a free pass at life. So it seems, but it's not actually free like their name represents, Freemason. They're actually enslaved by Satan and on their way to hell. Diego Val is hiding his hand in his coat. What? Are, who are those people that hide their hand? Um, uh, the Chuck E. Cheese? Uh, no, Freemasons hide their hands in their coats. Like many people of history, if you research this stuff, you will find out this is what the world is. The good news, the gospel of truth of Jesus who lived a perfect sinless life, fully man, fully God, died on the cross, shed his precious blood, was buried and resurrected three days later, according to the scriptures, the Holy Bible. This is the meaning of life. These people deny that and love the world and themselves. What else does Diego Val do? Let's take a quick guess. I'll give you a couple seconds. Do, 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 do. Of course, he's doing the Uttara Bodhi Mudra. Yes, it's a hand sign. You should recognize it by now. It means something. It's not nothing. It means something. Thank you, bro brothers and sisters. My poor attempt at singing the Jeopardy theme song, getting people to think, right? Oh, I love celebrities. They're so naturally gifted and talented. God has blessed them. Which God has blessed them? What are they involved in? Why do they do these gestures all the time, every day, every part of the world? It's especially actors and musicians because the entertainment industry, so many people want to be involved in that. They want fame, fortune, and success. I am one person that has never wanted that. And I for sure don't want it in the past, you know, eight years when I've been researching these things. 
I've done a lot of research with this. I've done a lot of soul searching. I'm not perfect. I don't have this all figured out. I never claim to. I am one Christian of the flock with my brothers and sisters who love God more than themselves, who love God more than the biblical world, who love God more than fame, fortune, and success. These people do not. They are erring. They are making an error. He's doing the Uttara Bodhi Mudra, and he's also doing the devil horns, the devil horns, one-eye symbolism, vow of silence, hide and, hidden his hand like a Freemason, and the Uttara Bodhi Mudra. I literally show this daily, and people don't want to get it. Do you know what that feels like? No, you don't. You don't know what that feels like. Does it take its toll mentally? Yes, it does. Because I know this stuff is true. I am literally showing it daily for years. Why am I doing this? Just wasting my time? Get a life already, right? You crazy Christian, you're a conspiracy theorist. I'm showing people the truth of the biblical world in hopes that the fear of God would hit them. The fear of God, it might not sound good to you. It's a good thing. It's the beginning of wisdom. Because you will humble yourself and go, I know nothing. I'm a sinner. I've said things that I regret. I've done things I regret. I've been a sinner. I'm on my way to hell. Except Christians that are born again have faith in Jesus, his finished work on the cross, that I mention almost every video. A lot of people are in the truth community, quote unquote, and they never bring up the gospel. That should be a big red flag for you because there's people that tell some truth and it's interesting, but this world is full of like rabbit holes to go down. I've been down those things. I've lost myself and been, you know, I wasn't standing on a firm, solid foundation, the rock of my salvation, Jesus Christ. But now I have been for many years. This guy's doing the Uttara Bodhi Mudra. If you say, what is that? Why don't you research it and find out for yourself? You're not believing me for some reason, even though I'm passionate about this and I'm literally showing it. Well, God bless you, everyone.